the granddaddy of all water cooler TV shows, is said to be possibly making a comeback. What show are we talking about? Stick around to find out. What's up, Universe, and welcome back to the web's first must-see comic and nerd culture show. Welcome to Comic Universe, guys. I'm one of your hosts, Zoe C-Dubs, and I'm riding solo all in this video. And guys, like I said in the intro here, the mother, the granddaddy, the godfather of them all, the one that got TV pretty much that changed and revolutionized TV as the way that we see it today. That's right, ABC's Lost is possibly in discussion, okay, to be making a reboot to the franchise. Now, Carrie Burke, the president of ABC Entertainment, in an interview, basically said that she she was interested in it. She she would entertain the idea. She basically flat out said it is literally at this point just what she dreams about every night when she goes to bed. So there's clearly some real interest on the from the president of ABC Entertainment, if you will. Now she also stated that the project is not in production. It's currently not in talk. She hasn't talked to J.J. Abrams. She hasn't talked to any other show, uh, you know, stars or writers or anything like that. It is just something that she is seriously considering. Now, with that being said, this could just have been something thrown out there. Now, this was reported a couple of days ago, and we just couldn't get around to it. But again, this could have been something just thrown out there, you know, a little fishing hook, see what they could snag, see if there was any interest, see if there was any buzz. Now, super fans like myself of Lost, you know, we understand the mishaps that that show faced. We understand from the get-go there were problems, to be honest with you. If you're a true fan, you understand that without clear direction and them just throwing shit at the walls to see what sticks was going to catch up to them. You cannot do that, especially when you're like the number one show on TV. You have to start trying to home it in, focus, and at least have an end game. So, you know, to, to lost detriment, that's kind of where the problem started. Writer strike, you know, that added as well. There was all kinds of convolution, if you will, new hires, things like that. So the show, unfortunately, may not have ended as strong as it started, okay? But there's no denying that I would say at least the first three seasons of that show are damn near perfect. They are some of the best TV shows that you could ever watch. They kept you coming back. They got you to buy merch. They This show revolutionized the way we see TV today. It showed us that you could have high-budget you know, high reward as well, you know, you, you make sacrifices in your TV show, people will come and watch it. This was not a show that you just, you had great acting, there, there was nothing really, maybe you could say the smoke monster, and maybe by today's standards, the smoke monster may look a little dated, but other than that, there was nothing cheesy about this show, they went hard on this show, maybe even the shark, the Dharma shark, you know, maybe that. But everything else, man, they went hard. Now, there are a shit ton of questions they never answered, okay? And even more that they alluded to. And even some of the ones we got answers to were not the answers we wanted, for sure. Now, when she spoke about, when Carrie, you know, she spoke about possibly interested in it, she did mention, okay, that it would be a reboot, so there's a re you know with a reboot you automatically start thinking negative condensation. Personally, for me, when I hear the re word reboot, very very rarely do I does it ever become better than the original. First and foremost, then you have on a rare occasion does it equal? Okay, nine times out of ten it's somewhere down here, and it, part of that is nostalgia for sure. But part of it is it really isn't as good as the original. Now, this is going to be a hard show to reboot if they ever thought about really giving this a shot. Now, the writers have also said they would be interested or and they would be okay with other writers taking over the show and kind of moving forward or kind of doing their own spin. Okay, so there is kind of the green light almost all the way around. Um, 
Personally, as a huge fan of the show, I would love to see it come back, but under the caveat of it being good, you know, it, it, it's very easy, again, to start off strong, okay, but for the long haul, I mean, look at Heroes, when they tried to make a comeback, you know, a lot of people liked it, I honestly didn't get around to seeing it, I heard a lot of good things about when it came back, but they had already done so much to tarnish their image and their brand that it really, even though whether it was a short-term thing or a long-term thing to come back, they really damaged their brand to where a long-term thing probably would not have worked, uh, to be honest with you. So Lost could find itself in that same category, but there's no denying that the whole Lost has given most fans, okay, still resonates today. Like, there's still nothing that has filled that gap for me. For me personally, you know, I really got heavy into to TV shows, and some of my best friendships uh, that I still hold on to today kind of revolve around a certain group of TV shows. Like, it's like, oh my God, did you see what happened here? And our friendship grew and blossomed. I'm talking buying the DVD and just binge watching every episode to where you just freaking pass the F out, okay, on your living room floor and your couch, if you will. That's how good my relationships and my friendships have come over some of these shows and Lost being probably the number one spot. So it's definitely something that I would, would love to see come back. In terms of a reboot, I don't know if a reboot's better or just continuing the series is better. You know, having a new group of people come in and trying to figure out some of the things that may have happened in the past or having maybe some of the reoccurring characters from the old appear back up on the island. So, you know, part of the mystery is gone with the whole you know, was it Limbo, you know, things like that. So part of the mystery of Lost is already gone, and they can never really take that back. But the good news is, is if they did reboot it, then a lot of times with reboots, things change. So there would be, again, that might be the best way now that I think about it, because the end game is really what matters, I think, when it comes to that show. Uh, and if it turned out to be something better and or greater than the original ending, I think it will give a lot of people closure and peace as to what actually happened, you know? Uh, again, I don't really know how I truly, truly feel, you know, whether it'd be better as a reboot or a continuation. I don't know if I want the old stars back. I don't know if we should cast a new one. Uh, so I just kind of put that out there to you guys out there in the universe. If you're a Lost fan, what do you hope? Do you want them just to kind of leave it, let it lie, let it die, let it stay dead? Do they bring it back, reboot it, and really give it a good college try, have an end game, have, you know, have some focus, get some good actors, and tell a, a real good story? Or do you think they just kind of pick back up? We all know that this is Limbo, and, you know, we just try to figure out more and more and more about it okay as the show goes on and we already know that it's limbo and that may be ruined but the the series can continue through mysteries of the characters if you will and do you hope something like that so let us know sound off in the comments below guys don't forget to hulk smash the hell out of that like button if you like what we're doing here guys if you don't feel free man put a thumbs down but i just ask in the comments give me a second tell me what's going on tell me why we got a thumbs down how we can make it better all right, that's the only way we can grow together, guys. And until next time, I'm C-Dubs, and I'll see you in the universe. Peace.